7 Eleven is the greatest idea. How 7 Eleven started in US? People were never getting newspapers. Uh, and these were very shady, small outlets where a lot of people would go to buy tobacco, cigarettes, they would go to buy liquor, they would buy sodas, and they would buy a newspaper. And these were run by largely Indian or a smaller entire thing. They were small shops, stuck shops where people would sell these kind of things. So it was a but still very convenient. It was just on the corner, wherever you need a knickknack thing, you went to Indadi. But what is 7-Eleven now? Kishor Bani has just done a tie-up with 7-Eleven to bring 7-Eleven to India. And they would open up a thousand outlets in no time in India. But do you think 7-Eleven is going to be the same in India? No, they will not sell liquor. They will not sell tobacco. What are they going to sell? They are going to sell ready to eat food. They will sell convenience. So the business keeps evolving. The chain has evolved multiple times. I have seen 7-Eleven but 25 years back. And when I see now 7-Eleven in, in, in Japan, it's a very modern outlet. It has all the uh, ready to eat food, uh, great uh, health options. So this business has evolved from that to entire thing because if you want it in Tokyo, you cannot run that same business because Tokyo is a very, very modern city. People are very, very extremely health conscious. They are very conscious about what they consume. Aesthetics are very different. The, the brand had ability to observe and evolve. Another brand which I was a big, big fan of is Starbucks. Starbucks is known for what? Coffee. You saw they changed their logo. What change they did? Anybody know that Starbucks changed the logo? About a year and a half back, you will never know actually. It does not look like very entire thing. But today try on Google. They had Starbucks and coffees written there. They took the coffees out. Very smartly, the company which is known for coffee took the from their logo coffee out. Because they knew that coffee is not big anymore. Tea is becoming big. So they know people are drinking tea. They are doing even coffee variants are becoming very, very different. Uh, and they are going to countries which are extremely hot. Uh, people want cold beverages. They don't want hot beverage. The young is not even having hot beverage. Right? So they knew what was coming. And they no more wanted to tell themselves that they are a great coffee company. So they are evolving as they go along and, uh, and they are changing the business model as it goes along. And